Well, I've got to say, I am disappointed with the second installment of the Project Veritas expose on the COVID cover-up. Hello and welcome to Sweet Home California. My name is Jennifer. Based on Monday's reveal, I was really looking forward to what was going to be coming out tonight because in times past, it seemed as though the more important things came out in the later installments. But tonight, it was just 12 minutes of an FDA underling who had an obsession with using blow darts to inject unsuspecting people with the vaccine. Yes, he wants to have a federal registry of those who are unvaxxed, and yes, he did note that the idea sounded very much like Nazi Germany. But are any of us surprised that someone like him would feel that way? If this person was a policymaker, yes, I'd be concerned. But it appears that he's just a sad man that I suspect doesn't have many friends, and he was just all too eager to overshare with someone willing to spend time with him, and obviously thought was a friend. He even says at one point, quote, if you are an undercover journalist, you can't quote me, and laughed. I really feel bad for him. Assuming, of course, that he doesn't have the power to do any of the crazy things that he advocated for. So what good came of this report? Well, I will post a link to the Project Veritas uh, actual video for part two in the description for you to see it for yourself. Then please come back and let me know your thoughts in the comments here. Please um, also like, uh, share, and subscribe because it helps spread the word about conservative content. And please keep everyone in prayer that has been affected by both the disease and the cure. And please also keep everyone in prayer that has been revealed in this series. While I think that the work that Project Veritas does is important and it needs to be shared, please remember that their, effect, their reports affect more than just the whistleblowers. Some of them may deserve it, but some of them may just be you know, unsuspecting bystanders um, and are, are hurt by this. Um, anyhow, keep the faith. I am sure that more is yet to be revealed. God bless you, and I will talk to you next time.